Apple will reveal the new iPhone 16 series in early September. You can see exactly when that will happen in this video. In the meantime, here's everything we think is coming for the iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro Max, the most powerful models in the series. And for details of the iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus, watch this video till the end. The latest report suggests that there will be new colors for the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max. There have been rumors that the new color would be rose gold. After all, this was popular for Apple some years ago. Apple likes pink and it likes versions of gold. The current range is quite muted, and this is likely to be the same this year, with a natural titanium option and one that looks wider than the current range. The black phone looks much darker than at present, but the current blue titanium finish may be dropped in, and that's where the bronze shade will drop into the range to fill the gap. The dummy unit shows something that's almost brown, which would be a new color. While the regular iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus will have a similar look and screen size to the current 2023 models, we can expect something different from the Pro models. The current 6.1-inch and 6.7-inch displays will be replaced by 6.3-inch and 6.9-inch screens, the biggest yet on the iPhone. That means bigger phones, of course but not that much bigger, perhaps three millimeters taller and one millimeter, wider on the 16 Pro compared to last year's phone and around seven grams heavier. The larger Pro Max will be around three millimeters, taller and less than one millimeter wider and weigh all of four grams, more than the current version. Both phones are expected to have the same thickness as now. The cameras will be improved on the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max with the Tetra Prism and the 15. Pro Max's telephoto coming to both sizes of Pro this time. New lens technology could also be deployed, and the ultra wide could see the pixel count increase from 12 megapixels to 48 megapixels. The new iPhone Pro models are expected to have an all new button designed for shooting video and taking photographs. It will operate like a button on a DSLR camera, allowing you to press and slightly to trigger autofocus. A harder press will take the picture. You can also swipe along the but into zoom in and out while shooting photos and videos. Some analysts say the capture button will be on the regular iPhones too. Processor. In 2023, the iPhone 15 and 15 Pro came with different processors. This year, all four iPhones will likely sport a new A18 processor. All four models will now have 8 gigabytes of memory as well. Faster Wi-Fi is likely to be on board the iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16.